hello everybody it's Sheila back again um, I've just received a parcel this morning from uh, Mariner's Jones um, this is the second parcel um, I've had from there I'm going to show you what um, what I ordered from you Stuff up and all. That's <laughs> uh, a cup of tea. That's it. Nothing down there, so I'll have to cut the top off. Bag inside as well, stuck down as well. I know this is a job. My phone now for the. They don't put a, um, a bill inside the um, the thing, but I've got it on my phone to tell you how everything, what everything cost. When I find it, yeah, it's, it's a bill on my phone. <laughs> Every everything's digital these days. You don't get anything with paper, do you? Um, first off was I got some. Three knitting needles, there's one missing. This is the one I thought they'd missed something off the order. And I got one set of twenty five centimeter knitting needles because I, I like these for when I'm doing tutorials and um, the big needles so I use my bigger needles they tend to clack on the um, the bench or the table anyway I'm doing the, um, the tutorial so that's what I wanted the smaller ones for and I ordered some of these the last time from Mariners but I couldn't get all the sizes they don't sell all sizes but I couldn't get all the sizes that um, they did sell so I've waited and I put the order in with this order and um, I've got the rest the rest of them there was one pair of 275 um, needles. They, they were all the needles were all 125. That was 275, three millimeter. These are for knitting the finer um, yarn. I like do I like using these when I'm doing sleeves and things like that. And I'm going to be doing some knitting for my uh, great grandkids at the um, the minute. So I'll probably use them for that as well because you don't need as big needles for <laughs> for smaller kids. Do you? and four and a half, four and a half millimetre. These were, they're all 125, so that was, that was good. And I decided to get myself some um, crochet hooks with the, um, I'll take it out of the, um, the pack, I can get it out. With the, um, that, I don't know whether they're rubber or, 
whatever that um, they're made of because my other ones I've got are all metal and they're all thin and when I use them they tend to roll around in my hand like sometimes when I'm using them so I thought I'll try these ones with the um, the grips and this one was um, I'm gonna find it One pound fifty. This is a six millimetre one and it was only one pound fifty. So I think that's good. And I also bought a um it was a pack of six with the grips on as well. And like I'm saying, I couldn't get all sizes, I wanted some bigger ones as well, but they only went up to these ones only go up to um a five millimetre. They're from 2.53, 3.54, 4.5 and 5 millimetre uh, in these ones and these was a pack of um, 6 for £5.50 so that was a nice a nice price and they had separate ones as well which was this one was and this was a, um, a 6 millimetre but that was the biggest they had in uh, those ones as well I would have wanted some some of the larger, like the eight millimeter um, sizes, but I'll have to look somewhere else for them. So I'm happy with those. And then measuring tape, one pound twenty. This is a retractable one. I have a one, you know, in my in a little bag where I keep all my bits and pieces, and I get sick of rolling that tape measure back up again and I thought oh that retractable one will be just nice so that was a decent price 125 what 20 is it no one one pound 20 I'm there 125 I'm gonna like that because I'll just pull it out and stop it let it back in again and these I've made pumps just pump pumps lately and I could really have done with something like that because um I haven't got anything to make pump pumps um with I just um cut out cardboard and sometimes it's hard to um you know when you have to split the two bits of cardboard and get the um wool in between and that and cut them to the right size but I saw my I was at my granddaughter's one day and she was making pom-poms for a, um a little mat she was going to make and she was using these and I forget where she said she got them from but she said they were reduced from £10 and she only paid £5 for them but these ones from Mariners were only £3.50 I thought that was very good this one two three four there's four inside inside there and then you've got all the instructions on the um the back there how to use them and that so I'll probably have a bit of fun with that I've just knit a little um hat for my friends friends <laughs> little baby that's not born yet and I had to do that by with the, um, the cardboard um, pom pom thing makers I had so I'm going to enjoy using that and now this here <coughs> now open it up this is a a bag where I put my knitting needles and things in I have an old one I'm going to show you I've had this one about 25 years <laughs> which I think needed replacing this was my old one and you can look inside you can see the plastic so there was plastic and it's it's starting to get brittle well it's been brittle for quite some time and I've been sticking it up with tape and everything and that and uh, the end of the zip's gone on it and I think the zip's going to go as well anyway but but hey it's lasted 25 25 years and I only paid about a fiver for it all them years ago and I thought that was a lot then. I don't know what the equivalent today is, but this one I've getting from Mariners was six ninety five, and it's exactly the same as that one. And I have to take the open the bag with everything. Open. Open. And I like this one because it's got the um, the balls balls of wool on the um the pattern and I'll open it up I 
and I also like it because it's clocked inside it's not plastic like uh, my other one and this one also has pockets has a pocket on the um, outside that's lined as well um, a nice cloth lining so I can put things in there and I'm very happy with that and I'm saying it's exactly the same as what I paid five pound for 25 years ago so I don't know what the equivalent to this would be these days size it's the same size size as that one as well so I'll probably take all the, um, the plastic out of the inside of this one and you can see there's bits of tape stuck there I've been sticking it together and I've had to turn this inside out to, to do it in the tape so the tape's coming off as well and everywhere so I'm probably going to cut all the plastic off inside that and uh, just use it for maybe some other bits and pieces of wool and that and then I bought this is five bowls of Mariners Double Knit Essentials. Um, when you order from um, Mariners, it costs you two pound ninety nine post package postage and um, package unless you buy twenty five pounds worth of um, stuff. That's why I've got all these things. I've waited until I, I could make the um, the order up to um, twenty five pound, so I get it um, post free and. This yarn was only a pound a ball and it's 100 grams, it's 100 grams, length approximately 300 metres and it's 100% acrylic and they suggest needles 325 to 4 millimetre. So I thought I'll get that to try it, it's the cheapest. I have a, um, a little bit more expensive where I got the last time was £1.20 but I thought I'm going to try this feels very soft I don't know where it's where it's like I might I might knit the boys a little jumper each um, with it to see um, what it's like but um, I like Mariners because I bought five bowls I bought the five rolls from um, Mariners because when I do a, um, oh, there's a hole in the bag. <laughs> when I do a, um, a sweater or a cardigan, I usually buy all of these packs of four balls. And sometimes, well, I'm knitting a sweater at the moment, and I'm not absolutely certain. I'm nearly finished. I'm halfway up the front, and I'm only hoping there's going to be enough left when I've done to, to do the, um, the neck because I don't sell single balls and that annoys me and this I'll probably keep on using this um, I haven't used the other, the other wool that I got from them yet so I'm going to try that and see what it's like and if I really like it I'll probably be using Mariners uh, more often um, I think and they also this wasn't in the, um, the package but um, they sent it um, it's a free pattern that um, they sent to me a uh, PDF, you know, in your email. And I printed it off and this is, I think it's the first customer um, one. So this was, a, um, I don't know, it's a scarf, it's a blanket scarf type and fingerless mitts. Yeah, and that's the way it comes down on the, um, the printer with the, um, instructions inside there it's um super chunky crochet i'll probably not be doing this it's not my sort of thing i don't like chunky uh, myself i put it was the only thing i could think of out of the patterns that the um that offered that might come in there you saw my granddaughter might like it so that was free so if you like my video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll show you anything else I get any time. So bye for now.